It's match racing day today for the first time in this San Diego World Series as the bottom six seeded teams from yesterday's racing battle boat on boat for the final spot in tomorrow's semi-finals. The day's racing started with two victories for the French team Aleph as they took on the Far East, first China team and then Team Korea. Pierre Pennock and his crew winning both races in style. Meanwhile, this morning, Oracle Racing has announced a new sponsor, Tag Heuer. Good news for Russell Coots, who's taking a break from sailing and concentrating on promoting the event. Well, not only getting the, the money, but the promotion. You know, I think we, we, we are really working hard to have a platform that young people will connect with, and hopefully we have more young people coming into our sport as, as a result of that. Next up, out on the water, Greencom took on Russell's Oracle Racing team and a win for the USA sent them through into the next playoff against Aleph, which was a thrilling match and again it was the underdog Aleph who came out on top, setting up for the final battle of the day against Artemis Racing for that all-important right to sail tomorrow. After some pre-start drama, Aleph had just taken the lead when the wind changed direction, race abandoned. We've had to bring them back, we lost all our boundaries. Restart and Artemis led for the first half of the race, but even in the extremely tricky light wind conditions, the left success story wasn't to continue, and Artemis celebrated their win. It feels like we survived it, and um, you know, hats off to the left guys and to Pierre. I mean, they sailed, actually, they sailed two great races. Yeah, it's good. I won't win to the Artemis, but it, it's normal. It's normal. Tomorrow, the San Diego Match Racing Championship continues as the top four go head-to-head -head in the semi-finals.